Today we're in District 7 in Koreatown, a very interesting and vibrant part of Ho Chi Minh. This hotel stay today is going to be very interesting because not only is it ultra cheap, but we are also not staying overnight. So let's see what this hotel has in store for us. So we've just checked out of our hotel and uh, I don't know about you, but I absolutely hate having to wait for six hours for the night bus in the lobby of the hotel or dragging all of our suitcases and everything to a cafe and sitting there the whole day. And uh, so we've decided to look for a place to stay until the evening and that's where Daydream Hub came to the rescue. This is a pretty new company and they specialize in day use, early day before you check into a hotel or late day after you've checked out of a hotel. And you can just rent rooms for a very, very good price. And so today we're checking out the Huang Yen Hotel right behind me. Uh, the price was pretty crazy. I think it was only like $16. And uh, I did end up choosing a suite for just over $30. So we're going to go and hang out here. And we've chosen this area because it's in Korean town. We've had so much Vietnamese food. And it would be so nice to just leave our bags, you know, in the room. And then just be able to explore a little bit and go back to the hotel and shower and rest until our bus tonight. So let's go check out this pretty nice looking hotel. The area is very interesting. There's loads of, you know, Korean and Japanese restaurants. So we're also going to go eat some Korean food today. And uh, yeah, let's check it out. There even seems to be a Huang Yen Hotel Cafe. So let's see. Upon entering the very bright lobby with the big glass windows, there's also a chandelier, high ceilings, these big wooden columns, loads of chairs and seats where you can work or relax a Christmas tree and a vending machine just next to the reception. Okay, let's go. So let's see what this uh, hotel is all about. All right, let's go. Wow. <laughs> that was absolutely unexpected. Yeah. <laughs> all right, it's uh, surprised. Yeah. That's all right. All right. I thought the room very normal, but actually it's also a little bit like Korean style. A little bit Korean style, yeah. It is a little bit older, of course, but uh, everything looks absolutely spotless, to be honest. All right, let's check it out. Let's see. Let's begin with the bathroom. Look at this bathtub. It's pretty cool. I am actually quite impressed. I've right, got a big toilet. I think it's pretty big too. Mirror. Big towel, little towel. All right, maybe the toilet used to be on this side, who knows? Let's go in here. So you've got a little high table here, a little bit scratched. But otherwise, yeah. Two little sofa things here, tea, coffee. The air conditioning is on too. Tea cups clean. Huh? We can cook outside. What? All right, all right, all right. Yeah, this room is uh, definitely more legit than we expected. All right, freezer. The, okay, it's not on, it's not plugged in. So perhaps you have to uh, do that yourself or call them in advance if you want a cold uh, fridge. We've got some regulations. In-room select items. <laughs> you can buy everything in this room. You want the phone? One million. You want the sofa? <laughs> Who's gonna buy the sofa? Who's gonna steal the sofa? Anyway. 10 million, perhaps if you destroy it or something or smoke on it, I don't know what. You can even buy the fridge, you can buy the desk, because you can buy everything. So much for this one. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, I bet you the flower is in here too. Let's have a look. Decorative flowers, 700,000. Wow. <laughs> so you've got your snacks, you've got your mini bar, you've got your noodles. TV is not gigantic, but that's all right. Oh, you even have a sink. Not bad, not bad at all. All right, all right. I'm getting more and more impressed by the moment. That's pretty crazy. You've got slippers, you can buy those too if you uh, decide to take them with you. And yeah, here's the bed. Queen size, not king size, but uh, that's all right, I have to say. All right, madam, would you please do the honors of showing us the outside part? A small mini kitchen. A mini kitchen. Yeah. You've got a chopping board, you've got a sink, you've got some utensils, noodles, bowls, a hob, a single hob. Let's see, two wine glasses, some more utensils, and uh, pots and pans. Now, for the grand, let's have a look. Oh, all right, well, this is not the room that we booked at all, because we booked a, a room with a park view. 
Now wanting to see the park view, we asked for our room to be changed. Staff were very friendly. They uh, apologized and said uh, they would move us to the park view room, which is apparently next door. So uh, yeah, let's go check that one out now. So we've been moved to the fourth floor to get our park view. The room is different. I think the little funny divider thing was pretty cool in the other room. But uh, let's see if our new view makes up for the difference in the room. I think everything else is pretty much the same. Kettle, fridge. Is this fridge plugged in? Oh, th now this fridge is cold, you see? Hmm, okay. Again, the same. Same. <laughs> but uh, this side. Yeah, okay, let's go see. Ah, okay, so uh, this here is the park view. Now, let's be honest, uh, when you hear park view, this is not quite what you expect. I think this view on this side is a bit nicer. That's a pretty nice building over there. What do you think, baby? If you have to choose between this room and the other room, which one do you think was better? I think this view also... Not, yeah, not, not much different. I suppose you're not coming to this hotel for the view. You're coming here to have a place to, to stay, lie down, shower, you know, relax before your flight or before your bus or before your boat. But uh, there is greenery, which is what they promised. So, and that is, I guess, uh, some kind of park. But uh, let's go back to the room to relax and to work and to eat something, which we want to go do just now. Now, you, we do know that if you're going to go to a place like this and you don't want to unpack your suitcase, you probably need some amenities. So let's see what this place offers because I'm surprised it offers anything at the price that it is. So let's have a look. We have a very thin, coin style uh, soap bar, toothpaste, surprised, branded soap and bath gel and branded some shampoo. We have a razor and we also have cotton buds and a comb and another toothbrush. Now, that is very surprising. I don't have to say, I don't expect it to be branded. Uh, do not try and smoke this. This is the tea. That's quite interesting. And this is coffee, I believe. Wi-Fi too. Lovely, lovely. So now let's check out how comfortable the bed is. Oh, wow. Okay, it's soft, first of all. That is much better than what we had in uh, in Moine. Well, that's pretty all right. That's pretty okay. Can't complain. Does it squeak? There shall be no squeaking tonight. We're now going to attempt to see if they will let us check out another room because the cheapest okay. room is only $16. So uh, I think we'll have to check out what a $16 room looks like. So here we have a superior room, which looks really nice as well. I do have to say for like, a, you know, if you're just staying here for like a layover or if you're having a short stay, this is absolutely fantastic. You have a nice little window there. Looks very cozy. A little table with chairs, some art. Perfect. So let's go check out the bathroom. And yes, you have like a wet room style, which is quite typical here. That's great. Even rain shower style. I'm very happy about that. That would be cool. So yes, I would say this is actually, I would say qualitatively on the same level as the, as the VIP suite, to be honest with you. It might be smaller, but do you really need any more than this if you want to work? I mean, you've got your TV over there. You have the same the same uh, mini bar and stuff, Wi-Fi, AC blowing directly on you if you want, an ashtray too, which means that must be a smoking room. Um, but yeah, sit there, do your work, go there, have your shower, rest here, watch TV there. I would say that's pretty good. I'm quite impressed with the hotel, considering like what we were expecting. I'm gonna get down to business now. We are in Little Korea. So there are lots and lots of options around here, all kinds of supermarkets. We're gonna go to the Japanese supermarket because I need to get like a lot of stuff, a lot of ramens. And uh, we also need to go to Vivo City, which is just around the corner. It's not far from here. That's a really big mall. And I uh, need to get some new shoes. And that mall is pretty cool. So uh, we're gonna go there. And there's a Manoa all you can eat buffet restaurant there. So we are spoiled for choice when it comes to food in this area. Anyway, I'll see you in the restaurant. So we've come up this like, it looked like a residential area, but it seems there's like a mezzanine walking area between the buildings that's full of like Korean restaurants and stuff. And there's a Kmart, there's 7-Eleven. Very impressive. All right, so this place gets some amazing reviews. Let's go inside and eat something. Xin chào. 
Now, unfortunately, this video does not do the food justice, but it was absolutely amazing. We had spicy chicken, bibimbap, kimbap, and all the sides that you could want. The food is absolutely delicious. The rating on Google is absolutely valid. If you're staying in this hotel, you need to come to eat at this restaurant. It's amazing. Also, the portions are absolutely gigantic here. So think twice before you order as much food as we have, because it seems that we'll be taking some of this food back to the hotel. So that was absolutely delicious. And now we shall return to our hotel, pack our things. Well, I mean, they're already packed and hop on the bus. Fantastic. I would definitely recommend this place if you want to be cheap and if you want to have a little Korean experience. So uh, yes. So if you like the video, please like and subscribe and follow for more hotel reviews, even if they are in the dark, just like this video. See you there.